Hello everyone and welcome back to Night of Wonder 2. Of course we're back with our Salt to Get playthrough and we're in a bit of an issue right now. We're kind of at war with the Seljuks and the Seljuks have four armies, but I don't think we're going to be facing too much issues considering the amount of people and the amount of armies that they actually have to fight. But that is not our only issue. Your the other issue is that we only history. have daughters. So once our ruler dies, which is going to be pretty soon considering he's old, we're going to have a succession crisis, and we're going to lose some crown authority, and it's going to be really bad. But how about we just focus on the wars for now? So the Shirvani capital is being sieged down currently by the Seljuks, but the Shirvani have a huge army sitting up here. So I would think eventually they would come down and relieve the siege. I would like to take Shimaki, but I think it would take too much of my manpower, and I feel like I should be fully focusing on the Seljuks. Now, of course, let's not forget that we also have this unification quest. We can form the Sultan of Rum. We just need to make sure that they don't exist and we control enough Anatolian provinces. But for now, we should focus on the Seljuks. I'm not sure what we're going to do here if we just want to take a whole bunch of land or what, but... We'll see, because I do want to focus on Anatolia, but we'll see what happens. However, just like our first war, there still is, like, nothing to pillage. It seems like they haven't been developing their towns at all. In all honesty, I kind of just want Shervan to be just, I don't know, just give me money if you want. Nah, you can't. You really can't. There's nothing really special here. They don't have really any good resources. And I don't just want to senselessly grow into Iran. I kind of just want to focus going west. So what I'm going to do is just, I'm just going to raid and cripple the Seljuks, really. I'm not actually sure how this works. I don't know if the character has to siege it down or if it's just an overall general thing for all my armies. Burn, burn. Taki has joined the war against us. My lord. Oh, Damascus has completely destroyed Jerusalem. Political I don't want to be fighting Shavon anymore. I haven't been really doing anything i would like to just white peace okay fair enough we are also sieging down Mosul right now we captured a new pro oh there's two mosques here that's perfect that's exactly what i needed i need some mosques so i can generate some religion i would like to just peace out man i don't want to fight you anymore it just why don't you, just why does no one have gold i have at least taken Mosul, and i don't really want to go further into iran like i really don't these bugs sire our oh, enemies were reinforced okay. in battle. Sure. Um, problems. Political we should try to wipe peace. Oh, us, fair enough. Have left the, battlefield. the Romans are our angry? Wait, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm actually very confused. Oh, they attacked Edessa. Oh, I didn't know. I thought they were at war with me. I thought... I thought they were at war with me. Everyone around me doesn't like me now. It's not like I needed them to like me anyways, though. Tragic news. There it is. Our king is dead. Our crown or Negative three crown authority. Oh my god. Big Chagatai, our merchant, has taken over. At least I had some leftover rebels in my prisons to um get rid of. Sorry. A war okay, sure find declare war me once again. They're coming straight from Van. Yes, they are. Like we, we already have a massive garrison in the city. I mean, this is their only two armies. Oh my God! The settlement damn near has every resource in the game. What? What? Holy sh! I need that. I just need that in my life. Both armies completely stack wiped. Would like to maybe save it for medicine. Of course, I would like to save it for medicine. That's just a ridiculous ridiculous amount of pops i think i've said this before in a past video but like medicine is one of the most essential traditions so much population you get from this right, let's just replenish and then we'll immediately turn around and go for shavon there's no garrison unless i just immediately try to get there as quickly as possible i was in the middle building up my economy to get siege equipment oils ropes i believe tar and sulfur as well so I have a lot of very good resources to help my siege weapons, but I don't have siege weapons yet. I was saving up for that, but now I'm at war, so... Yeah, let's get medicine now. Look at the amount of population we have now in our cities. So you have a lot with happiness and culture power as well. 
help these guys get more loyal, become my culture. These guys are still, these guys still have disorder. I don't really care. They'll eventually switch over. I stand by my strategy of just not using a dot population because it's just, it's just hit or miss and it costs way too much resources. I mean, I don't, that's a lot of raiding to be done. Dessa doesn't seem to be able to fight, really. Soljics are also over the Dessa. Uh, yeah, I'm. I might as well just join. You take a Shimaki, and like this is just insane. The amount of resources. Holy shit! Now I finally get some siege workshops. Everyone really wants me to attack the Romans. I'm gonna actually have to put some serious consideration into that. Um, I don't really think I can end trade with the Byzantines, I'll be honest. My, like, 90% of my economy is reliant on trade with the Romans. I seriously do not think I can actually go to war with them. I might need more trading partners, honestly. I might need to shift my focus. Because I'm way too reliant on the Romans right now. Fatimids probably... Wow, they really love the Romans. Maybe not, actually. So let's see in Armenia could... Probably be a good trade partner, actually. Our merchant. Who likes them? Pretty much all the Middle East except the Romans. So they shouldn't get attacked by anyone around them other than the Romans, really. So that should be fine. I think now I gotta divert my trade, really. I gotta try to divert my economy from being so reliant on the Romans. Prince, Holy shit, what happened here? Given... It seems that many people there were offended by his preaching, though, and his visit was treated as an attempt by us to convert their beliefs and loyalty. Negative 330 relations with Byzantium. We have a son! Okay, he's going all the way into Marshall, apparently. Oh my, they're all level 15! Dude, the, the Romans are actually insanely strong. I mean, I kind of really have to help them. I kind of, I actually really might need to attack the Romans because they're like a genuine threat. You know what? It's time to recall you. In the meantime, I have completely maxed out the Viticulture building here. So it's given us a lot of commerce and a lot of extra resources. Actually, we can get missionary. I haven't realized that. This is a massive attack. I. Oh, his really? successor. Our merchant's opinion has suffered. We have angered oh, our nobility. One of our knights God. is not governing a My lord, war has been declared upon us. <laughs> Dude, what is wrong with you? Oh, two actually very professional armies. Okay. Sire, Just go straight for Shimaki then. I don't really care. Alright, let's fight battle, this. Sire. We have completely stack wiped their two armies. Oh, that was a huge battle of Malatia right now. This could be very big actually. The Romans could lose some armies here. Once I deal with Shravan, I think I'm gonna... I don't know if I should attack the Alanians or the Romans. I think I should go for the Romans, honestly. Just... just fucking charge into Anatolia. Xantian plan to, plans to invade us? Ah, well... That just solidifies my decision to attack the Romans. Meanwhile, I'm making a full cavalry army now. With my... Uh, leader as the leader of the army. I I can't speak English sometimes. This is the army that's going to conquer Anatolia. If there's ever an army that's going to conquer Anatolia, this is it. We need to make sure we get additional troops. Get as much cavalry as we can. This is exactly why I am making sure I'm making so much food. And I'm actually making a lot of food. 25 food in this town specifically. This sounds also making a lot of food. Splendid work, sire. We've won our war. Shirvan is gone. I think it's about time that we think about war. There's nothing. There's not even a garrison in Malatya. There's a ridiculous amount of rebels here. Malatya is going to be the easiest one to take. So we'll go for that first. Then we'll go for... Kayseri will probably rebel by the time we get over there. Ankara is... Wow. Lots of garrisons, and wow, dude. I don't even know if they can really hold on to this land, especially while at war, because they've been at war for a very long time, so I can only imagine their war exhaustion right now. And they're about to be in another war. Oh, there's so much good raiding to be done. Okay, we're, we're definitely ready for this. Oh, they just put a garrison in there. They really garrisoned that so fast. They're so strong. This is great. Oh, 
That's an insane trade center. We have the Cilician Armenia and Damascus helping us as well, so... Alright, I think it's time. Let's just go for it. Declare war. Our crown authority yeah, I lost crown authority because we had a trade agreement. I can actually just increase that. Oh my god, man. Varangian guards, Pronoia cavalry, Roman infantry. Oh. Oh, don't tell me you're just coming straight here. Okay. Hmm. Okay, we've relieved the siege of some set. We're gonna, gonna just replenish. The stretch so far, they have so many wars, so many people they're fighting. Trade center move. Oh, I have a trade center van. Oh, that's such a good trade center. Non aggression pact? Political. Really? Uh, honestly, I'll take that. Actually. So, Lania can't attack me. Surely I chase them down. Not, not doing that, not doing that, not doing that, not doing that. Come on, you can catch him. So close. Oh, Antioch is here as well. Oh, it's, it's over for Actually, what the hell? Why is it so close? I think it says balance because of all the cavalry, but oh, what is the population? Fucking hell. Absolute destruction, and my horse archers aren't being touched at all. And it's gonna be a complete stack wipe. That Pranoia cavalry is terrifying. We're assaulting it. No, 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 no. That was actually quite bad. That was actually super bad. Oh no. Oh no. I should not have come and help. Oh, the moment I went in. Oh no. Um, god damn. Yeah, the that's bad. That's that's really bad. I can't leave either. Wait. We have received oh, no. a diplomatic message, sire. Our king died while fighting the enemy. Oh no. Oh no. That was we have increased such our crown authority, my a lord. Dumb mistake. Oh, that was so Oh, that was- I- I have- I- I can't even speak English anymore. I'm- I- I can't- I don't even- That was- Only the finest That was so produced. dumb. I've- I've lost two full armies. I- I don't know why I didn't just stop myself from going to help, because the- the siege was- was going to be lost anyways. I know- I don't know why I didn't stop myself. Alright. I am but a soldier. Release me. Now I will show no mercy. I can't believe I've done that. I I genuinely cannot believe I, I actually did that. A catastrophic setback. God, I do I do not make that much levies at all. Remember levies? I definitely need to work on that. Anywhere with castles, really? Not really. This would be an insane place to make a like a a military settlement, military town. I just, I ha I honestly just have no idea what I've just done to myself. No, I do know what I've done to myself. I fucked myself completely. Wait, how much is that? 15,000? But then they can get a fourth army up. They have two of their armies down currently. Now, no, I'm just gonna think about it. I'm just gonna sit it. I'm gonna let it sit there. I'm not actually gonna accept it. There's your three infantry tactics, field tactics, laws, three, bargain. How about, just let me how about we just do it? Let's just invite him. We now have a Roman on our side. Pillaging my god, they're fucking cataphracts. Oh my god. So much elite cavalry. This is stupid. This is insane. This is insanity. I feel like I should win this. I have a full cavalry army in there that just that just went to uh, back them up. The message just didn't do anything. Ah, I mean, there is a crusade against them, to be fair. No way we lose this. Okay, we gotta retreat. Our army was defeated while pillaging a settlement. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. The Lysians have also left. Okay, right. So it seems that I've, I've, I'm in a, I'm that bad. This is so bad. What is? There's no way they're actually attacking with that army. From officer join our work. No way. What? Absolutely. Huh? We win this. Yes, we are. Yes. Oh my. God, okay. Arrived, okay. That's an army destroyed. Oh my god, they only have- oh wait. Uh, now their emperor is a leader now. Okay. Romans are- 
extremely strong, man. Crusade was defeated. That's huge. Well, I mean, they still still got some land, but they, they they didn't get Jerusalem at least. Okay, in exchange for me declaring war on the on Jerusalem, uh, the Damasc Damascus has joined the war against the Romans once again. If I can get the Seljuks here, I don't think they would help me though. I finally have an autograph back with the Seljuks. Can I have your help? No, okay. Oh no. 7,000 men, by the way. Should I have this much confidence? No, but I do. Oh, you guys could help. I don't even need the fucking help. My army's destroying them. Thank God for the cavalry. Holy. Wow. Honestly, this makes me kind of just want to forget about the Romans. I don't think I can get any tribute from them. There's no shot I get any tribute from them. We have won a uh, war, sire. Our enemy offers peace. What? Sire, we have pleased our nobility. Honestly, I'm shifting my focus on Elania. It's going to be hell to take this, so... And some gold, please. Sire, we okay, won our war thank you. And this city will fuel our military. Honestly, what I really need to do is just get independence of room. That's really what I need to do. Advantage. Advocating an advantage. Masonry. Look at the amount of levies I make now. Room really likes me. Like, they love me, actually. 1,000 relations. I am quite strong. I have been sitting here just building up my armies. I have all three fully, completely maxed out armies. I think it's about time that I try to get independence. I'm just going to try it. Sire, oh, we are free from well, there we go. Sovereignty. And that is huge. That is a our huge goals, burden sire. on our economy gone. We were like... Uh, giving him like 60 gold a month. Oh, we have a very similar color to Damascus. In fact, it looks like we literally have the same exact color. Should probably go to war with Edessa. Very, very weak because they just took these lands in the crusade. Yeah, we're gonna attack Edessa. We've pleased our... Is there a reason I'm attacking Edessa? I mean, I guess there's sheep. There's no real reason just other than just more land, I guess. Sire, we've conquered another province. Splendid work, sire. We've won our war. I'm gonna declare one room. They have our truces up. Uh, we are friendly, we are, we're trading, but like, they're super weak. They have one province. Like, we might as well just put them out of their misery. Our enemies have been. Our king has died. There we go, he's finally and dead. And after all that, I think we're finally ready to attack the Romans wish? once again. We have. Three full armies. We're not what very command? good commanders, though. I mean, I have to like, continue wish? upgrading them. But two full cavalry armies, yeah. and then one more infantry-oriented army because of this guy, Simeon. Uh, it's funny that we have a Roman on our side fighting for us. He has infantry tactics three, so that's why I gave him all the infantry. God, Mehmed, I think, is ready to declare this war on the Romans very soon. I have... An invasion plan set up with Damascus, Comania, and Hungary, so they'll be attacked from three different sides. My economy is incredible, and I have just been putting so much work into this city specifically. I have fully maxed out stoneworking, maxed out metalworking, I have gold smelting, I can get even more. Even as well, I actually have uh, royal armies built, and I can actually build more. And I should put some heavy units in these armies before I declare the war, though. We are definitely much better equipped to fight the Romans now. But of course, I will save that for the next episode. Um, I hope you enjoyed this one. It was uh, a roller coaster indeed. That, man, I really still cannot believe I, I made that mistake. But we, had, we did make a comeback. We've made a comeback. We're okay. We, we didn't fall apart at least. And our next goal is to invade all of Anatolia and, of course form the room sultanate we should be able to do that if we take all anatolian lands in this one war and i think we could do it realistically all these territories is probably gonna take like two wars anyways i hope you enjoyed if you did please feel free to hit the like button and if you are new here and you like the content of my channel please consider subscribing anyways it's been out to next signing out see ya Ha <laughs> ha.